Okay, it's me. Um, I'm here at uh, the, uh, the Indian Mounds that we refer to as Hell's Gate. And as you can see, it's, uh, it's about 5.24 in the morning. And uh, I've already had something really weird, really strange happen. And I wanted to get this down while it's fresh in my mind. Um, I got on the levee road that leads to the, uh, the Indian mounds here. And I've probably gone maybe a quarter of a mile heading, heading this way. Maybe a little more. And as I'm approaching on my left-hand side, there's this big farming building. Well, over on the right side of the road, right, right in the grass, just out of nowhere, I saw eye shine. And, I mean, let's be honest, there's deer out here, there's possums out here, there's raccoons out here, there's, you know, there's all kinds of things out here, but that's the normal things that you would see, fox, uh, coyote, I, I mean, that, that's what you're going to bump into out here. But, um... This eye shine was huge. I mean, it was, it was, it was, oh my God. I mean, it, it was, it was ridiculously large and bright for eye shine. It wasn't a deer. It wasn't, of course, it wasn't a human. Humans don't emit eye shine, but you know, it wasn't, it wasn't something that would be native to the area. It, it this was huge. I mean, the 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 circumference, and I saw I saw eyes. I saw, you know, what would be eye you know eyeballs. I mean, but it was glowing so bright. I, I would say that the what was radiating was probably a good foot and a half, you know, kind of oblonged from eye to eye and kind of glowing, you know, uh, uh, around the edges. And here's the kicker. From ground to eyes, I estimate it was at least six foot it, it had to have been from ground to, to eye shine at least six foot tall and uh, I, I just I was blown away I was just totally blown away this was about 15 minutes ago maybe 20 so around five five ten As I'm easing down here towards the mounds, that's 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 what I see. And you know the sun is slowly but surely starting to come up. But I, I'm just sitting here. I'm I'm parked with the engine running. Um, You know, I'm, I'm, I'm looking, I'm aimed towards the two mounds that are on the left-hand side of the road. And uh, the main mound is, is behind me, which is not a very comforting thought, knowing that I got my back to that main mound and considering that's where a lot of the, you know, activity 
seems to be centered and probably rightly so but again just to review coming down the road you know may, maybe a I don't know half a mile maybe maybe a mile tops before you get to the to, to the Indian mounds at Hales Gate I shine huge huge oblong you know blazing amber eye shine at least six feet off the ground and 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 here's the thing whatever this was it looked up and saw me and and and, and it 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 did not blink as best i can remember it did not blink and bat its eyes but you know, if it was like a deer or something, it would have, you know, you probably would have seen some head bob. You probably would have seen, uh, you know, a, a little bit jerky motion. I mean, now, now don't get me wrong. Deer can be very graceful when they, when they move. And, you know, sometimes when deer see vehicles and stuff like that, they're not scared. They're, they're not really worried. Um, and whatever this was, it wasn't, you know, just like, I need to get the heck out of Dodge. But when this thing moved on off further to, to, to the field or into the field and, and maybe down this little rise on the levee road, it was real smooth. It was real fluid. And I'm just going to come out and say it. It didn't act like something on four legs. This acted like something bipedal. This acted like this was a, a, a solid fluid movement like a human would do or something on, on two legs like, like, like a human as it would move off. And when it turned its head and moved down, the eye shine disappeared. I mean, I, I, I cannot sit here and tell you that that was not freaky because that was very freaky. Again, eye shine, probably the, the length of, of the glow from, from, from side to side, at least a foot, foot and a half long, probably six or seven, eight inches high, and, and two distinct eyes. I saw eyes and brilliant a brilliant amber at least six feet off the ground okay guys it's me um i didn't mention this earlier after i saw those the eye thing let me get a my watch pulled around here i think i documented it but uh it's uh, Sunday, 11.05 at 7.17 7 in the morning. I've been out here at the Indian Mounds at uh, Hell's Gate. A uh, little over two hours now. And uh, I've heard some weird sounds. Um, definitely heard some barn owls. But I heard one sound that, that was really strange that, that it didn't, you know, I, it didn't really sound like a, 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 an owl, but owls make some really weird, strange sounds. But this sounded more kind of, I don't know. I don't know, it sounded something like that would really come from the throat, you know, something, something not, uh, not bird-like. I don't know. It, it just sounded. It it, it it sounded like a like a little yelp that that Sasquatch are, are known to make at times. Uh, something like that. But you know, inconclusive. But strange nonetheless. But the the strangest thing obviously was those large glowing amber eyes that were about six foot off the ground back that way so i mean like i say that uh that that kind of shook me up 
about five o'clock this morning. So it, it kind of reminded me the eyes, the, the, the way they didn't flash like what I'm fixing to describe, but it just kind of put me in a frame of, of, uh, of, of mind of uh, the first Predator movie with Arnold Schwarzenegger. When, when the Predator kind of swung around the tree and his, and his eyes flashed, it, 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 it reminded me of that. It didn't do that but it just kind of reminded me of, of the predator, the way the, the, way the eyes kind of, you know, blasted that light out for a few seconds. So anyway, this is kind of just to tack on and conclude. I'm fixing to pack up and head home. But um, anyway, a eventful morning at Hell's Gate. So, anything else happens I'll cut the camera back on but I'll put these two videos up uh, uh, as soon as I can so until next time this is Marcus signing out catch you later